Hey guys, so I finally have a chance to share my hair routine with you today. My hair was looking decent today, so I thought it would be a good day to film this. But I have a new shampoo set that I've been using, and I feel like it's made my hair a lot healthier. Well, looking anyways, you can't really make your hair any healthier once you've damaged it. But I think it's made my hair a lot smoother, shinier, and healthy looking, so I wanted to share that with you guys. It is a Japanese brand. This is the brand name here, L-E-B-E-L, Lebel. Neber in Japanese. I found these at a beauty salon and I just fell in love with it and this is the treatment. Treatment is just like a heavy conditioner, like a deep conditioning thing. I use these too. I don't use any regular conditioner. My hair is pretty damaged so it needs all the moisture that it can get so I really like this this heavy conditioner but this smells like roses, like a fresh bouquet of roses, not like a gross fake floral scent. It's so nice. So I love the smell of this and I love how it makes my hair feel. It feels very like light and clean and I think it smooths out lots of my frizzy broken off ends from dyeing my hair so much. So I'm very happy with this shampoo. I recommend it to anyone that has a similar hair texture to me anyways. I can't really say how it would work on anyone else but I have very fine hair. Like each strand is very thin and I've bleached and colored it many times, so it's very color damaged. So this is very great for colored hair. It doesn't make the color fade any faster than it usually does. Um, it's definitely better for that than other shampoos. And this deep treatment, I use this every time I wash my hair. So that's usually about five times a week at least. Sometimes I wash it every day. But it's a very thick, creamy, deep conditioner and after I shampoo my hair I put this on and I leave it on for as long as possible until I get tired of waiting in the shower so usually about I'd say five to eight minutes or so I'll leave it on there but you can leave it on for longer if your hair is more damaged and then you rinse it out so those are the only two products that I use in the shower and then when I get out I towel dry my hair get um, most of the moisture out anyways and then I use Moroccan oil. I just love this stuff. I think it really helped my hair. It's made it look a lot healthier. It smells amazing. I don't really know how to explain the scent of this if you've never tried it, but it's definitely a scent that anyone would like. It's not one of those ones where you either hate it or you love it. It's, oh, it doesn't really smell like anything that I can compare it to. It's just amazing. I use the light version. It says it's good for fine or light colored hair. My hair is both fine and light colored, so I prefer this one. I feel like it doesn't weigh your hair down as much. But if you have thicker hair, definitely go for the regular version. But yeah, I pump that once or twice, um, spread it all out in my hands, and start on the ends because they're the most damaged and dry. And I put lots in there, and then I kind of work the extra up towards the roots. I don't put it like right on top because this area usually gets pretty greasy normally, so I try not to get any up there, but I just focus on the ends. And then I let my hair dry, air dry as much as possible. That's definitely one thing that you want to do if you can, if you have the time for, because blow drying your hair is very drying and damaging. So if you can, air dry it for as long as you can. And then if it's almost dry, then you can start to blow dry it just to get the final, kind of like straighten it if you want to, or add some body to it with a round brush. And then once my hair is all dried, if there are any parts that need to be straightened, usually my bangs need that and there's usually some like stubborn curly pieces under here that I like to straighten. I use a ceramic straightening iron for that. I really like this one. I've had it for probably like five years now so it's getting really old and dirty but it is the Solia Professional Ceramic Ion Flat Iron and I got this from a website. I forget which one it was. I haven't Folica? dot com I think anyways if you just if you want this exact one you could probably just type the name in online and find it several places I think this was a pretty well-known brand but I really love this straightener and I've had it for a long time it wasn't cheap I think it was close to a hundred dollars it might have been a little more but it's lasted me five years and it works very well and it's got a temperature setting so if you want to um, have a lower temperature to not damage your hair as much you can do that and yeah I really like that 
So that is all I do for my hair. I really think the main things that, that have helped it the most are trying to use as little heat as possible. And this shampoo is just ridiculously amazing. I would recommend it to anyone. I want you to try it. Even if it doesn't help with the healthiness of your hair, you would just love the smell of it. I can't get over how amazing this smells. I wish I had a perfume that smelled like this. Just like fresh roses, seriously, like a real rose. It's amazing. This is also silicone free for those of you that care about that. All right, so that is my current hair routine. Again, it really depends on your hair type. My hair is pretty oily and the texture is very fine and I color it a lot, so it's very damaged. Um, but if you have similar hair to mine, I would definitely recommend these products. So yeah, thanks for watching guys, bye.